Hi, I am Lou Remisar, director of the documentary Stranger at Home, currently in production. And I want to thank you for your interest in our veteran struggle for better mental health care. Now, in this short video, Vietnam veteran Richard McCormick reveals his experience with symptoms of PTSD. When I initially came back from Vietnam, I told my mother, I said, Mom, I'm home. And she started crying and, you know, I said, yeah, I'm good. I got all my limbs and this and the other. She says, no, you changed. Then it was so much the baby killers. I, I, I didn't want people to know that I was a veteran uh, because of the negativity of the Vietnam War. We were baby killers. We were, you know, scum. I mean, you know, and that was the reception that, you know, we received. And um, that affected me too. Being of the young man coming back and Johnny comes marching home again, it wasn't there, you know. So, yeah, I mean, I felt, I felt horrible for what I've done. And not telling, not expressing what happened to me in country, uh, but what, what I was feeling, I had suppressed it. And then when it got to the point, then I would, I would uh, do drugs, man. I hated doing them, but I know once I was um, high, I didn't have to feel what I was really feeling. I was feeling anger. Um, I was, you know, hurt. Um, I, 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 you know, I mean, I, I was just, I felt lost. Um, love. I didn't even know what that felt like, but me growing up, I had a loving family, you know. Um, but all that stuff kind of like went out. I grew up and my heart had hardened, um, not towards people per se, but towards myself. Please lend us your support by visiting our website and signing up to make a difference.